Hi, this is Danielle with Pearly Shell Fiber Arts, and I am here. I have already spun two spindle folds of yarn, wound it off in balls. Now I'm going to make a finished yarn. And what I need is a bowl from the kitchen. I'm going to put my yarn, my yarn balls in there because I really hate chasing them all over the living room because inevitably one ends up under the couch and finds dust bunnies. And I don't really like dust bunnies on my yarn. I am going to take the two ends off my yarn balls. Okay, I'm gonna set it down between my feet and my spindle and my leader. I am going to add twist, but today I am going counterclockwise, not clockwise, counterclockwise. Added twist, and I am going to lay these on there and let my twist follow up into them. Okay, and I'm gonna add more twist counterclockwise yet again. Take a little, it'll feel a little weird at first, but then you let the twist in and you're making finished yarn. A little bit more twist. This is just so it catches onto my leader really well. Okay, that is a good little start. I am going to wrap it down around my spindle to hold it in place. And now I am good to go. I am going to counterclockwise. And I don't have to really worry about drafting. I just see how I just add enough twist to the yarn so that it is a nice, relaxed kind of yarn. It may still twist up on it a little bit, so but that, that comes out in the end after we set it. But just so it's not hard, it just kind of flops around. So I am going to continue to do that until I have ran out of one or both of my balls. It's okay if you have leftover in the bowl and you'll have a finished yarn in the end.